What is up, people? Today I have this meter, a Westinghouse D5S meter, and it has a stamp on the back of the nameplate saying that it was made in 1997, the seventh month. Um, this meter I got on a website called Vision Metering. Um, this meter is running on my C phase line. It's in, currently in a socket type meter, socket type cover removed next to my. GE I210 also running on the C phase line. Um, have 200 amp wires coming in. Goes to the bus bars. It's a standard type meter. We'll just put the cover back on. Um, this meter is a pretty good meter. It's made in. The reason why I like Westinghouse Brown brands the most is because they're made in Coopersburg, I believe, Pennsylvania, the state that I live in, United States. That's where their international headquarters is. Um, so 200 amp meter, 240 volt, three wire, 60 hertz. Tested amps is 30, and the kilohertz constant is 7.2 has a serial number of 5570C26G43. Um, yeah, and that's it, I guess. I'll give you a top view. Has all metal gear trained in it, good quality. Um, Westinghouse has got bought out by ABB brand in the 90s and then ABB got bought out by Elster. I have an Elster meter here and the only thing they changed throughout their history was the color of the nameplate. If you can see they're exactly the same and those Elster meters are made in the US and the Pennsylvania too I believe. Um, currently like they're still made today. They're the only analog type meters still made today for the United States. So, um, yes, thanks for watching.